Digifort Insight is a very powerful module that allows you to view, record, and remote control any Windows desktop machine from within the surveillance client. In this example, we have two machines running the Digifort Insight module, which is free of charge, and all you need is one license per monitor that you want to record. So, as you can see, it seamlessly integrates into the system as a camera channel. You can drag and drop the channels from the list, and it just works and behaves like a camera. Here we have one desktop and another desktop machine, along with my cameras. If I want to remote control this machine, all I have to do is selecting this button here, so I click on the button, and now I'm controlling the remote machine. I'll just make it full screen for a better view. So here, I'll click on the control, and now I'm remote controlling the mouse from the, that machine. I can open here the menu, I can work on, any, on anything, like if I was um, on that machine. I can also type and use my keyboard. So, for example, I'll open Notepad, and this is a test. So, with this tool, you can actually use for tech support, like if you want to provide support for a remote support for your users. You can also use Digifort Insight as a tool to record whatever your users are doing. You can use Digifort Insight as a way of showing, for example, um, a dashboard from a system that is desktop based or remote control any kind of system or even use it for um, integration of systems inside uh, Digifort. Because everything is recorded, you're going to have all your images and all your um, inside cameras recorded in A264 or MJPEG streams. So if I want to playback, I can just click here, multiple cameras, I'll get one minute ago, and there you go. Now we have insight here on the playback, where, and everything is being recorded in, in the server. I have my cameras and everything synchronized. So, for example, if you have some d dashboard software uh, that is showing the status of something or a machinery or anything, everything will be recorded in Digifort. And if you want to control that machine, all you have to do is just put the, the, put the camera on the screen, click on the button, and now you're remote controlling any, any machine that has Insight installed. Additionally, in order to actually send keystrokes to the remote machine, you have to make sure that your scroll lock button is pressed on your keyboard. This way, the system will know that you actually want to send the keystrokes to the remote selected machine and not use the keystrokes locally. So, if I select here and I'm controlling the machine, now my, my scroll lock button is uh, selected and I can, whatever I type, is going to be sent to the machine. But if I deactivate the scroll lock and try to send anything, it won't go. Digifort actually used a special PTZ driver to send the commands for mouse and keyboard control to the remote machine, which means that you can actually assign rights to specific users to remote control the machine. So if you don't want your operators to control a remote machine, you just have to remove the PTZ rights for that specific desktop. Because it behaves just like a camera, it also has the rights like a camera. So if we get here and you get the user rights, you, you can just select if the user has the PTZ control right. That way, if the user does not have a PTZ control right, he will not be able to remote control that machine.